and we brought the boss baby with us today. Do you like it? What? <laughs> you like it? I like it. Well, he's going where I need you to come. Back in the day, Drake, who's now our oldest, was crew, and he was just with us. It's almost like we're taking a trip down memory lane. Crew, let's figure out how far. Now step over that obstacle. There you go. Keep going. Hit the wall. Keep going. Oh, nice. Watch. <laughs> okay, I have a tiny little change order in the entryway. We were going to do the tongue and groove. You're not changing the tongue and groove, baby. We've already got it going. I want to do this black and white kind of cloud wallpaper above it and on the ceiling. The definition of a change order is a thing that comes into Joanna's mind two or three times a week. If you look it up in the Webster's Bookionary of Dictionary Efficiency, <laughs> oh my gosh, this gum is dying to jump out. out of my tongue Get area. We know that this. Hey, crew, crew, listen to me. Do you want Mama to do a change order? I did. Mama, I did a thing. He said, Mom, let her do her thing. Oh, right? Yeah. OK, well, sounds good. High five. Yeah. Okay. I was hoping for him to say no change orders. But crew said, Mommy can do whatever the heck she wants. Cancel the tongue and groove. Oh, yeah, yeah. So I have six rolls of this, but because of the pattern, you okay. buy this in a batch of six. So I if see. I need one more roll, you I have buy, to buy, buy a whole nother and batch. I, I am not doing that. I'm going to double check to make sure that we need less than six That's rolls it. in this space. <laughs> you want to go play hide and go seek? Oh, Where's feed, crew? buy, no. oh, oh. I smell the blood of an Englishman! Yeah. Ah!